You don't need a lot of clothes in order to have a variety of different outfits for any occasion. In fact, you can transform any basic outfit from casual to party, from sporty to an office look, even bohemian into more modern 90s look by keeping the same base and just accessorizing it. Never heard about accessory sets? Then you definitely need to watch this video till the end. I have received a lot of requests from you ladies to tell you more about accessory sets, so I have decided to make a special accessory edition. In this video we're going to talk about what is an accessory set and how to build it, what are the must-have accessory sets for any stylish woman, and how to mix and match accessories in the outfit in order to dress it up and down and adjust it for a certain occasion. I have noticed that a lot of my clients are scared of accessories. They're terrified. They have no clue how to choose accessories, how to mix and match them in the outfit. Therefore, they try to play safe and go for the same safest option, like black shoes and classic black bag which make their outfit look quite the same all the time and really rather boring. So I have built accessory sets for my clients so that they always have a matching set for any of their outfits. Accessory set is basically a pair of shoes and accessories perfectly matched together in terms of color, finish and style. And because these accessories are so aligned with each other, you can wear them with any of your outfits without even having to think how to match a separate item with another one. Color is the key criteria in the matching accessory set. And by color, I don't mean that you need to choose the same color of shoes and handbag and other accessories, because that would even look rather dated. No, not at all. But when we want to build an accessory set, we need to match accessories in terms of color values, which is the depth, the contrast and the temperature. For example, if I take this handbag and try to match it with these shoes, you can see that this combination obviously doesn't work. The handbag has muted warm medium dark hue, it has warm metal details, whereas the shoes has high contrast dark and cool color palette. It will be very difficult for me to build such an accessory set because I will have to match every new item in the outfit with another one in terms of color. However, if I match these shoes with this purse, because they have the same color palette, black and white, they make a perfect match and go with any outfit. So in order to show you how I can pair different accessory sets with one outfit and transform it for different occasions and different styles, I took a very simple base, which is white t-shirt and black leather pants. Pretty much everyone has this combination already. So since I am a mom of three boys, my favorite style is definitely sport chic. So my first outfit will be sporty yet elegant. I start with cinching my pants with a belt. It's black with silver metal, quite minimalistic, so it goes with everything. As a top layer I'm going for bomber jacket which is not only on trend but also very comfortable and perfectly fits in my style. I'm going to wear a navy sweater as a scarf and a navy baseball cap to support sporty vibe. And to finish my look I will go for navy round sunglasses and my first accessory set as well as my first spot chic outfit is ready. So to create my first sport chic accessory set I used black and white trainers, black and white tote, navy sweater, navy baseball cap and navy sunglasses. And the color palette I used here is black, white and navy. If I want to add some pop-up color, I can easily swap navy sweater for a mint green and it will immediately make my outfit more fresh and colorful, which is great if you want to introduce color into your wardrobe but not ready to go for bold colors head to toe. I personally think that a sport chic accessory set is definitely a must have for any modern woman, no matter how old you are, what you do or what your lifestyle is, because it's comfortable, modern and always makes you look fresh and up to date. To transform my outfit from day to night and switch the color palette, I went for a neutral accessory set. I got this beautiful beige pumps with black net on top and because they're already quite statement, I paired them with this nude boxy bag. As you see, they're not the same color, but they are from the same neutral color palette, which make them a perfect match. I also swapped t-shirt for an open shoulder of white top to get a more feminine look and there you go. That's my evening look with a neutral accessory set. And to create it I used beige pumps and nude mini bag. 
and the color palette for it is off-white, beige and nude. Finish is another important criteria when it comes to building a matching accessory set and we have a huge variety of different materials and of different finishes. We have matte and more plain ones, we have more shiny textures uh, like patent leather for example. And again it's not about the rules, it's more about the guidelines. When it comes to mixing and matching finishes within accessory set it's quite tricky to mix two three bold textures in one set. So I would say it's easier and safer to go for one more bold finish and keep the rest quite neutral or combine two three different similar textures and finishes. Have a look here, I have this beautiful metallic sling bags and if I try to match them with another bold finish such as velvet for example, it will definitely clash, it will be too much. But if I go for the similar shiny finish, a little bit more subtle such as this beautiful hobo bag in brushed leather, it will look just perfect. For my next lunch date outfit I decided to bring some pop-up colors, so I opted for a neon pink shirt. I wore it a lot in the summer, but I really feel like bringing some fresh, flashy accent now that it's so grey and cold outside. Shirts are perfect layering pieces and also a nice way to add color accent to your outfit. I could easily swap this shirt for a denim or flannel one if I want to make my outfit more functional and warm. I also accessorized my outfit with layered jewelry, which is sort of a must have for me. Here I also added this extra chunky chain to support metallic shoes, sunglasses to complete the look and I'm ready for a lunch date. My dress up accessory set is metallic sling bags, white hobo bag, belt with metallic buckle, chunky metal chain and hoops and minimalistic black sunglasses. Style is a very important criteria when it comes to creating a matching accessory set and even though it's quite difficult to set a certain criteria when it comes to style and matching accessories in terms of style, I would say the easiest way is just to go for one bold accessory or one bold pair of shoes and keep the rest quite neutral, quite subtle or to quote the same style. For example, if I take these western boots, which have a very bold style, and try to match them with this clutch, which is already quite statement and has its own style identity, it would just clash with each other instead of bring up a consistent style story. So I prefer to go for something more subtle, such as this cross shoulder bag. It matches in terms of color and scales, and it has this sort of rough, rock chic, sporty vibe. So to transform my basic outfit into rock chic, I added a waistcoat as an extra layer to add structure to the silhouette and to support my rock chic accessory set. I tied a small scarf around my neck as a color detail and at the same time to make my outfit more edgy. I kept the bomber to add some sporty vibe into my outfit and black sunglasses to complete the look. So my rock chic accessory set is western boots, scarf worn as a bandana, padded cross shoulder bag, black minimalistic sunglasses. Here you go, two items have this rock chic vibe and two are more modern minimalistic to bring balance to the outfit. Another way to match accessories is to go for contrasting styles. For example, if I want to create accessory set with these masculine loafers, instead of going for some sporty cross shoulder bag or a chunky tote, I pair it with a clutch or this ladylike handbag in patent leather. I layered white t-shirt with men's striped cardigan to add some pop-up color and make my outfit warmer, chunky chain on top of my necklaces to accentuate the neckline and spice up the plain t-shirt, sunglasses to finish the look and I'm ready to go for a meeting and pick up my kids from school afterwards. Accessory set I used here is masculine loafers, ladylike handbag, belt with metal buckle, chunky chain, and big black sunglasses. When it comes to dressing up the outfit, we definitely need some party vibes. And that's where embellishment comes in play. And talking about embellished shoes and accessories, it's not that obvious always how to mix and match them in the outfit and how to build this accessory set in order not to overdo with accessories and not to look like a Christmas tree. I would say the rule of thumb, again, goes like 
match similar embellishment within one accessory set or go for one bold more embellished accessory or shoes and just pair it with more neutral more subtle ones i just bought these gorgeous embellished sling bags gucci inspired and because they're already quite bold instead of going for another bold accessory as this pearl embellished clutch which will definitely make me look like a christmas tree i opt to go for more modern options such as metallic chain mini bag from paco Rabin, which will definitely add the sparkle but not clash with the shoes and make the entire look more stylish, modern and pulled together. If I went for casual drinks with my girlfriends, I would honestly keep the t-shirt, rolled up the sleeves to make the silhouette more feminine and dressed it up with only shoes, metallic bag and the chunky chain. If I want to go for full party vibe, I just swapped the white t-shirt for metallic body and paired my outfit with the same accessory set. My party accessory set would be embellished sling bags, metallic chained bag, belt with metallic buckle, chunky chain and hoops. I would say a party accessory set is definitely must have because most of the time we still want to dress and feel casual even if we go out but at the same time party accessory set can easily adjust any basic look and not only make us look more appropriate for the evening but also boost our party vibe which is great. Et voilà, that's it for today. I hope you got some confidence and inspiration to build your own accessory sets. Please share in the comments if you already have your favorite accessory sets. And thank you for watching. I will see you on Thursday. Bye!